Hallo, hallo, hallo und herzlich willkommen zurück zu einer weiteren Folge von Catch in the Back. Alter, ich spiele das. Ich suche das Spiel durch. Jetzt haben wir ein neues Kapitel. Und tun wir die natürlich annehmen. Oh. Be on your guard, Traveler. Now is no time for sightseeing. Oh, why is that? Has something happened? Yes. As unusual as this may sound, numerous eyewitness reports have confirmed an active ruin guard presence in this area, even though this is far beyond their normal area of activity. Sergeant sent someone to find out just where these ancient machines might have come from. It appears that they simply left their ruin and marched off all of a sudden, for no clear reason. So did somebody wake them up? As I say, the reason is still unclear. We have very little intelligence at present. Moreover, the ruin in question is of the especially spooky variety. Strange noises are often heard coming from within. As such, we are not permitted to investigate until the order comes through from headquarters. In any case, the only sensible strategy in the meantime is to increase Millilith patrols. We must not let innocent civilians come to harm. That's a good point. Ruin guards are probably pretty dangerous for regular folk. Wow. Uh, I'm very grateful indeed for the offer, but it just wouldn't be worth the risk. Oh, don't worry about that. This one beats up ruin guards for breakfast. Is that so? Well, if you're genuinely offering, I did see some ruin guard footprints on the hillside. But since then, I've been too busy warning passersby to investigate myself. Footprints, eh? Interesting. We'll take the case. While the Millilith stands guard, evil shall never prevail. On behalf of the Millilith, I salute you, traveler. You have my gratitude. I will rendezvous with you once I have finished my patrol. Ja, dann machen wir das mal. Footprint is huge. It has to be the one that guy was talking about. And here's another one. Yep. Seems the ruin guards did come out for a walk after all. The trail of ruin guard footprints leads us here to ah! a ruin guard over there. Now done. Komm, steh auf. Unturned. Ich werde anstrengen. Windblade. As a good knight should. Leave it all to me. I'll protect us. Ha! <laughs> Verdict is Run away! Yo. 
mal wieder hier hoch. Gut. I must leave no stone. Let the show begin. Das war knapp. Komm runter. Komm. Kaputt. I'll protect us. Komm her. Komm, Puppele. Komm, Puppele. Burn. Ha! Ha! Ausdauer. Das wird ein langer Kampf. Steady as stone. langer Kampf, ey. Macht nix. Komm, 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 die Luk. Nicht heule. Ready, 
bin euch bald tot. Wir haben gegen Level 71er gespielt, ne? Also. Mit so niedrige Zahl, ne? Also. Let's dance. Okay, alle geheilt. Gut. <lacht> wieder so einer. Leave it all to me. Hey you, check this out. Isn't it awesome? What is he wearing? I've never seen one this close before. Have you ever seen one? Ihn kennen wir doch. Um, excuse me. His name is Mr. Cyclops actually. What sort of dumb name is Ruin Guard? Mr. Cyclops. Oh, that's cute. Wait, what? Do people seriously call him that? Yep, my brother said so. And he's the best toy seller in the whole world. It's his job to sell this kind of stuff. Right now, he's at the Institute for Toy Research in Lira. That's where Mr. Cyclops has come from. It's always nice to meet someone else who likes toys. So tell me, where'd you get your toy from? Must be a pretty new kind, huh? I've never seen one that can fly and talk before. Yeah! Hyman is not a toy! Greetings. Have you found anything? Oh. A child? W what's the situation here? We just, you know, found him. Uh-uh. You shouldn't be out here, boy. There are killing machines in the area. It's extremely dangerous. Killing machines? You mean, ones that look like this? Precisely. And including this one. It's not moving now, but if it were to wake up, the consequences would be... You take that back! Mr. Cyclops <clears throat> is not a killing machine! He's one of the good guys! Um... Mr. Cyclops? We shouldn't be talking to this guy. If he's saying mean things about Mr. Cyclops, he's definitely a bad man. I, I, I'm just trying to help. I've always been hopeless at dealing with children. Well then, why don't you get back to your normal job and leave us to do the babysitting? <sighs> It seems I have no other choice. Very well. I will continue with my patrol. Please escort the child to somewhere safe. It's much too dangerous here. <laughs> the mighty Mr. Cyclops scared off the bad guys once again! My name's too, sir. I came all the way from Snezhnaya to look for my brother in Liyue. But I'm all on my own, and I don't know where to find him. My name's too, sir. I came all the way from Snezhnaya to look for my brother in Liyue. But my name's too, sir. I came um... all the way from Snezhnaya to look for my brother in Liyue. But I'm all on my own, and I don't know where to find him. My name's too, sir. Um, I came all the way from Snezhnaya to look for my um, brother in Liyue. But I'm all on my own. And I don't know where to find him. Hey, äh, Leute, ich glaub, wir machen kurz Pause. Er wie ein Krischpiel. Also, bis gleich. I'm all on my own. So, Leute, ähm, wir sind wieder hier. Ähm, ich habe jetzt was anderes gedrückt. Also, ihr habt die Szene jetzt leider nicht gesehen. Aber ihr habt gesehen, ähm... Es hat sich wiederholt. Also ich weiß nicht, was da jetzt gerade bei dem Spiel los war, aber irgendwie hat sich es wiederholt. Jedenfalls haben wir jetzt das Geld angenommen oder so, wie das heißt. Ähm das Geld angenommen und jetzt müssen wir zur Bank gehen. Wir haben jetzt ihn erst gefragt, das oh, ist also regnet, warte mal. Ähm, wir haben erst gefragt, wie er heißt. Er heißt Trenzer oder Treuenzer, wie auch immer. Und da hat sich das Spiel immer wieder, ihr habt ihr gemerkt, wiederholt, 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 wie so endlos steife. Habe ich Spiel beendet, neu gestartet, war es nochmal. Hab ihn aber dann gefragt, wo, wo seine Familie ist. Und er hat dann gesagt, in der, 
in seinem Bruder Snartnitz oder sowas, glaube ich. Und er wohnt in äh, Junge und so. Jetzt haben wir das Mora angenommen und jetzt müssen wir äh, zu der Bank. Bank des Nordens müssen wir jetzt gehen. Also, ja. Dann gehen wir mal dahin. Also die Folge wird zusammengeschnitten jetzt, weil irgendwie hat sich das Spiel aufgehängt. Ich habe keine Ahnung warum. Ja, mal so, vielleicht spiele ich das Spiel viel zu oft und habe schon viele Parts aufgenommen. Ich bin jetzt gerade bei keine Ahnung wie viele Part. Ich muss im Voraus schon viel produzieren. Deswegen spiele ich die ganze Story und Farm ohne Ende, weil ich habe jetzt nur noch diese Woche Zeit. Weil nächste Woche habe ich, muss ich wieder arbeiten und dann heißt es wieder drei Wochen. Leave it to me. All of it. Whatever it is. Und das Problem ist ja, nächste Woche hat man wieder viel Arbeit zu tun im Geschäft und ähm, da habe ich leider keine Zeit zum Aufnehmen oder sprich, ähm, ja, andere Sachen machen. Deswegen mache ich das diese Woche noch, weil ich diese Woche noch Urlaub habe und danach, ähm, ja, schauen wir einfach mal. Also die Folge wird zusammengeschnitten, ne? Also. Mann, oh Mann, nee, das Spiel hat sich nie aufkam. That seems a little inappropriate, don't you think, sir? How can you? Relax. Once in a while can't hurt. It'll be fine. Huh? What is he doing here? I know that voice. Why, if it isn't my little brother Tuser, my goodness. <laughs> What a nice surprise, Tuser. I thought it would have to wait till I return home before seeing you again. How are the others? Sister Tonia and brother Anton? Is everybody keeping well? They miss you a lot. Tonia prays for you every day at dinner. Wait a second. What are you doing here in Liyue, Tuser? How have I not heard anything about this? Well, what happened was... I saw a boat that looked like it was selling toys, so obviously I thought you were on board. And then, when I got off, I just kept walking and walking, and then I found a Mr. Cyclops! Mr. Cyclops scared off a bad guy, and then I found this nice lady to help me come look for you. And also, Tuzer's child's brother? Cool, suddenly Paimon doesn't feel so bad about taking Tuzer's money. Tuser, what you did was extremely dangerous. I'm so happy to see you, really I am, but please, promise me you won't do anything like this ever again. <sighs> okay, I promise. Please don't be mad at me. <sighs> I'm not mad at you. I just care about your safety, that's all. If you hadn't met these nice people, things could have been a lot more dangerous for you, Tuser. I hope you said a big thank you to them. Yep. I always remember my pleases and thank yous. Oh, so you did notice we were here. You were just ignoring us. Gotcha. <laughs> Forgive me. It's always family first where I'm from. Don't take it personally. I know we've had our differences up to now, but a few minor quibbles aside, we get on quite well, don't you think? Huh. <laughs> Come on, you know I'm just a pawn in all that, just doing my part. As for who wins, who loses, and how each side deals with the consequences, I prefer to leave all that up to the ones playing the game. I'm much more interested in who wins and who loses when it comes to our little sparring matches. Hmm, sounds like you're ready to get your butt kicked again. Ha, <laughs> you're forgetting something about me. I, Tartaglia, spend every second getting stronger, Don't expect to have it quite so easy next time. Whoa, 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 whoa. You aren't gonna fight now, are you? <laughs> Maybe not right now. Not while my kid brother is watching. Why do you want to fight the nice lady? Are you guys enemies? No, not at all. Allow me to formally express my sincerest gratitude for taking care of my darling brother. His safety matters very much to me. Um, so anyway, Paimon has a question. Tuser said something about you being a toy seller. What's that all 
all about? Aren't you supposed to be one of the Fatui's harbor? Ahem, uh, yes, about that. Shh, look. I only told him that so that he'll look up to me. In the eyes of a child, working with toys must be the best job imaginable, right? I don't want my family to have anything to do with the Fatui's, or should I say Snezhnaya's, darker side. The older ones already know that I serve the Tsaritsa, but Tusser is still so young, and in his eyes... Ahem, <sighs> as I was saying, I remain Snezhnaya's greatest expatriate toy seller, currently attached to the Liyue branch of our Institute for Toy Research. That's right! My brother's the greatest! He's Mr. Cyclops' bestest friend! Just humor me in front of two, sir, if you would be so kind. Ah, uh, yes, Ekaterina. I will deal with the issue of that outstanding payment right away. Hey! Slinking off, are we? But, Master Child, would it not be a little improper to ask you to deal with... debt collection? A bet is a bet, isn't it? And if you lose a bet with an agent... <laughs> well... You might as well get a little exercise out of it. Are you going off to sell toys now? That's right. As much as I'd love to catch up a little longer, Tusser, duty calls. I'm sure Miss Nice Lady here will be happy to keep you company while I'm out, though. Ah, <sighs> so we still need to keep babysitting for you? Sure! I really like this lady. And anyway, she made a pinky promise to take good care of me. Ah, well, it sounds like Tusser really likes you, and that you've already made a pinky promise to take good care of him anyway. Then I'm in your debt. Here, take this as Tusser's entertainment fund. I want him to have a good time while he's in Liyue, so take him anywhere he wants. If need be, you may find me by the river near Qingxiu Pool. I'll see you both around. Jetzt immer sowas wie Babysitter oder was soll denn der Quatsch jetzt? Oh Gott, oh Gott, oh Gott. Looks like we'll be hanging out with Child's kid brother for a while. So, 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 where are we going to play first? Um, how about we start with the toy store? Sind wir Babysitter hier? Alter, er geht's noch oder was? Try your luck betting on Jay? Huh? What are those super colorful winged things? They're called kites. The kids in Lily love them. Hello there, dear. You look like you've come a very long way. A let granny guess. From what you're wearing, I would say... Snezhnaya. <laughs> That's right! How do you play with these kite things, Granny? When the wind picks up, you let out the string and... Whoosh! The kite will fly into the air, up, up, and away. Wow, that's amazing! Do you have any Mr. Cyclops ones? Mr. Cyclops? I'm sorry, I... I want to fly Mr. Cyclops high into the sky so all the kids can get to know him! Well, I can do custom builds, but I'll need some amount of reference material. Will this picture do? I drew it myself. I bring it with me everywhere. Hmm... I'll manage. Still, I must warn you that custom builds can really be quite expensive. Ah, uh, we should be fine. Child was pretty generous with that entertainment fund. Um, but then again, throwing money around willy-nilly is, you know, kinda irresponsible. Well, um, so, yes, technically speaking, these funds are earmarked for Tooser's Entertainment. But if there's any leftover when we're done... Either way, it's time to talk prices. Mm. 
Vielleicht muss ich jetzt okay rein. Fine, fine. I've neither the time nor energy to bargain with you at my age. I suppose this price will do. <laughs> Thanks, Granny. Worry not. Just leave it to me. For our next stop, why don't we head to One Man Restaurant? What should I it would try? be a mighty crying shame to come all the way to Lila and never try the food. Babysitter für alles essen gehen, Spielzeug kaufen. <lacht> oh Mann. <lacht> Hello, welcome. Table for three? <lacht> This restaurant has a really choking smell. A choking smell? Oh, you must be referring to our signature spicy chili scent. Spicy chili? But I can't eat spicy food. Oh, what a pity. A person who can't eat spicy food misses out on half of life's joys. Is it really that bad? My meals have to have lots and lots of sugar, and the oil has to be extra virgin vegetable oil. Wow, we've got a real rich kid on our hands. Looks like Wanman Restaurant's dishes aren't a Tucer's taste. Maybe we should go somewhere else. Will that be all? Any more special requests? Uh, what do you mean, Chef Mal? <laughs> Giving the people what they want is the very reason Wan Min Restaurant exists. If I thought for one second that I couldn't make a dish to satisfy this child's taste, I would have absolutely no business calling myself a chef ever again. Whoa, there seems to be a lot of professional pride riding on this. Then we'll leave it to you, Chef Mal. We'll be eating here after all. Sure. But let me say this first. Special requests are going to cost you more than normal. Of course, we aren't going to demand prices anywhere near as exorbitant as the likes of Lili Pavilion or Sunyue Kiosk. Is it just Paimon? Or are premium custom orders in fashion lately? Still, <laughs> surely there must be a little room for negotiation, right? Well, oh, machen wir mal. <laughs> oh, you folks. Uh, let's go with this then. Any more haggling and we'll ruin the other customers' appetites. <laughs> Thanks, Chef Mal. Please sit wherever you like. Your food will be here shortly. Ooh, it was a little too sweet. Paimon feels a little sick. Oh. <sighs> I thought it was just right. Almost exactly like how my sister Tonya makes it. But this doesn't feel right somehow. Didn't we bring Tusser here to try Lila's specialties? Eh, whatever. So where do you want to go next, Tusser? I was so caught up looking for my brother when I first got here, that I didn't get a good look around. Good idea! The hustle and bustle at the wharf is a specialty of Liyue Harbor, too. Try something new at the Wanmin restaurant. Cheap and tasty chop suey! Ach, Angle. Alter. to help Tuser get to know the place. This place is Lila's commercial hub, and it's been the biggest port in the Seven Nations ever since it was decided that Lila would take on the world through trade. Other than merchant vessels, many fishing boats and industrial transports dock here to replenish their uh, fishery supplies and daily necess necessities, which thanks to the immense 
throughput, capacity of the wharf... Um... Ah, uh, yeah. Paimon can't remember how the rest goes anyway. Well, guess Paimon will just have to explain this Paimon style. So this harbor is like Tavat's mouth, and it's the biggest mouth you've ever seen. All the nations float their boats over the sea into the mouth. The harbor goes om nom 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 and has a taste of each boat and the cargo it has on board. Then, Lyra Harbor rubs its big round belly in satisfaction because it's all stuffed full of delicious mora. Hey, what's that big metal hook over there? <coughs> I want to see. Wait, Toozer, don't run off. Uh, after all that, he wasn't even listening. Hey. The metal hook is huge, and it gets bigger the closer we get! This is an anchor. Docked ships use it to hold themselves in position to stop the wind and waves from blowing them away. <sighs> an anchor. Got it. But I think I might get it mixed up with Commodore Hook. Commodore Hook? Is this another one of your weird toy names? My brother always sends me a really big toy for my birthday. Commodore Hook, Black Steel Jack, Iron Tony, we keep them all in our backyard. Yeah, and that's why I can't bring them with me all the time. It's a shame. Wow, using Fatui funds for personal gain? To think Snezhnaya would let their harbingers do that. All for some giant toys. But suddenly, it doesn't seem so strange that Tusser would treat a ruin guard as a giant toy. But my favorite has to be Mr. Cyclops. Even though I mostly came here to see my brother, the other big thing I wanted to do was play with Mr. Cyclops. Oh, are they selling fish over there? Let's have a look. Hey! Quit running off! Oh, money. I find the right group. Is this where they sell fish? Wow, the fish here in Leo are so... Small. Hey, whose fish are you calling small? Little kids shouldn't go around ruining others' business. He's just a curious kid. No need to get worked up. That said, these fish are actually pretty big by Paimon standards. Just how big are the ones you're used to, too, sir? Um, maybe 200 times your size? There are legends in my hometown about it. It's supposed to be a super delicious fish. I told my brother about it, and he went out to sea to catch one for me. A few days later, he returned with a humongous fish slung over his shoulder. Anthon and I were so happy. Are you sure that was a fish? Paimon thinks it sounds more like some sort of leviathan. Hey, Miss Nice Lady, let's go over there to see the boats. Ugh. <sighs> <sighs> What's wrong, Tuser? Are you tired? You don't seem so happy. I miss my brother. What? But we were just with him. Yeah, but for such a short time that it doesn't count. Take me to see my brother. I don't want to play anymore. Ah, <sighs> yep. You can have all the patience in the world, but it won't help you at a time like this. Well... We've played with Tuzer long enough, haven't we? Paimon thinks we've tried our best here. Child said that he'd be by the river near Qingshu Pool. Why don't we look for him there? Yay! Let's go! Let's go! So, aber das sehen wir in der nächsten Folge. Ich bin wirklich gespannt, ey. Mein Level geht so schnell wieder hoch. Boah, Strecken. Und dann würde ich sagen, wir sehen uns bis zum nächsten Mal. Macht's gut. Euer Sony als Gaming. Ciao.